This is the work of a genius. Did you know that the movie Who Am I that was directed by Jackie Chan and has him starring as the main protagonist where he speaks Sichuan fluently in the great RSOE. I'll explain more on this after the rankings. Or if you really mean you can just skip to the end and see it if you don't love me. Ultimate power. We're a hundred seconds to midnight, baby. And this batch of rogue could get me my honors degree because we have two doctors and a floating brain in a jar on a bear. Dr. Kamakazi. All I ever wanted was to control the entire world. Not so much to ask, it's so long denied me. Dr. Hunch Doofenshmirtz. Doofenshmirtz Evil Incorporated. Where being evil is not debate. You know what? I should really write the rest of that someday. And Hector Concarne. My name is Hector Concarne, and I will one day rule the world. <laughs> Let's go. The bathrobe, thick. The glasses, thick. The accent, thick. And his henchman is built like a brick. He is the ruler of Kaziland, Dr. Kamikaze. Poison. Schmoizen. I make and break the rules around here. Is here to do two things capture Robot Boy and use him to take over the world. But soon, soon, it will all be mine. <laughs> Knock it off. The first step has been accomplished many times by many people, even by his former orphan brick of a henchman known as Constantine. I just kidnapped Tommy's girlfriend. And caught them when they came to rescue her. What? But his ego always gets in the way of step two. An inevitable failure followed. But uh, I saw him defeated. How? Constantine, I blame you! Robot Boy runs on batteries. Just wait for him to power down. Now, but no, somehow you gotta just F it up. I mean, this man has, has the ability to make armies for himself and he's being beaten by one robot, but whatever. But the thing that really gets me is that he has an entire island that has a volcano as his HQ and no major authority has tried to swat him or, you know, take him to jail. I guess they just fear him that much. So, what is his ranking? Wano, Wano, that's it. Simple reason is, in terms of memes, he has none. You need those memes, Holmes. No memes, no goals. Run, run as fast as you can. Can you catch me? I'm the Kamikaze Man. Second, Hector Concarni. The Mexican playboy jillionaire who got blown to kingdom come by Commander Cod. And now he's attached to Buskov, the bear, along with his stomach, which also survived the explosion, and gained sentience. He sets up his evil base on Bunny Island and started Evil Concarn to complete his plan to take over the world. Complete with mad scientist, first general Scar, and an army. I feel like I should fire my research team. What the hell did I just read? Okay, so he has the starter pack and the resources and you know what comes afterward. Failure, incompetence, and the dumbest L's I have ever seen. He could have easily won by eating Commander Cod, but instead he makes the dumbest decision I've ever seen. Finish him! Evil! I'm just in time for the 705! I thought you were bad! You ain't bad! You ain't nothing! He has no memes also! Why don't they have memes? Honestly, it's very sad. But the world doesn't care! And I'll give you the rank you deserve, Trash Panda! Know your fucking place, Trash! Whoa, that's like... Fucking mean. Oh, boo hoo! Let me play a sad song for you on the world's smallest violin. Well, 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 well. If it isn't the innator making, mantis posture looking, time travel monetizing, time chips, don't share with a friend. Those are mine! 
self-destruct button and installing, death cheating, trap making, platypus fighting village boy that made a name for himself, Dr. Heinz Doofenshmirtz. On the one hand, all of your plans have blown up in your face. Quite literally, in fact. But on the other hand, your memes, Madhu, are so ingrained into my and many others' minds that the human brain reads them in your voice out of respect. That is the same level as Lesotho living rent-free in South Africa. Why do we have a sovereign country living within South Africa? I don't know. So with all that in mind, it's time to rank him. And he goes right there. Now, I'm sure you're asking yourself, why? 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 I'm asking why! Well, there are three reasons. One, his self-destruct buttons make beating him a matter of find a big red button and press it. So his threat level is manageable by anyone with spare time. Second, the stuff he makes is legitimately threatening to the world or at least the tri-state area. So that still makes him a legitimate threat. But last and certainly not least, and I cannot stress this enough, <clears throat> It's my wall, and I do what I want with it. All right? Well, let's be nice. Yeah. Let's be nice. We don't have to go there. <laughs> I mean, you're not wrong, but you didn't have to say it. I mean... Now, I'd like to thank you very much for making it to the end of the video. And as promised, Jaggy Jen speaking Sichuan. Like, what? This movie made my week, quite possibly my year. And this movie is a year older than me. It has existed longer than I have. And I only found out about this on Monday. This movie has boggled my mind. Like, when this movie was released first in China, all the English was dubbed over. But the Sichuana was untouched. So Chinese people had Jackie Chan speaking Sichuana at them. It's like, come on! Oh, thanks to my boy Tess for bringing this to my attention. And for all of you to making it to the legitimate end of this video. Be sure to conduct the YouTube goodness, it helps the growth of the channel. And be sure to tune in next time when I attempt to kick the back of my head. Ta!